Oh, I know what I want to talk about. Okay. Tell me. This is something that I, that has always been like really funny to me. What? It's obviously not a funny topic, but we talked about this before. We were talking about um we we're talking about pedophiles and people who get caught with like terabytes of porn and shit. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. And we were like it's just it's funny that you hear these like horror stories, these people who get caught. I mean, obviously it's bad, but they go to these like bunkers set up like an Indiana Jones movie where when you walk in they're rigged with explosives. Wait, really? Yeah. You call you coined the term pedo bunker. Yeah, the pedo, the pedo, <laughs> pedo bunkers. Where the second you open the door, it's like a Rube Goldberg machine goes off and all these cords get pulled and like it hits a fuse and everything explodes and shuts down. We're saying like they don't have a few gigabytes. It's always like yeah, it's, it's like so and so has been caught with eighty-seven terabytes <laughs> of <laughs> grainy VHS footage of nude children. <laughs> Like, where do you even get that much? See, like, we talked about oh, this. Fuck. Oh. They have to say they could run the footage continuously oh, no. for 87 years straight. We, I was Not saying, like, they all. probably have, like, 180, like, peak, pic like, j massive pictures and video footage of this stuff. <laughs> or it's all, like, Blu-ray, because... I don't know. I've never used a terabyte of memory in my life. Do you know? Do you don't think that's part of uh, like just I don't know normal psychology where once you discover like that is... downloading movies and like videos and shit, you you go overboard at first. No, no, no. I I always thought it was like a fear tactic, right? Like, oh, oh this fucking this pedophile downloaded eighty terabytes of child porn. <laughs> it like it'll like set off radars because it's like nobody would download fucking eighty terabytes of. Like, I don't- I, I can't even, like, think of something to, like, even compare that to. Like, it, music? 80 terabytes of music? I can't even my, download, my like, My entire hard drive is barely music. a terabyte of data. Yeah. But yeah, I get, what, you, I, I get what you're saying, Corey. It's pretty fucking messed up shit. It is weird. <laughs> it is kind of kooky. I just, I just think it's funny. You think they, like, categorize it and, like, it's all, like, properly labeled, like, prevent- <laughs> <laughs> When me and my friends were younger, we, when we discovered porn for the first time, we would categorize our porn and give it to each other. You organize shit like an autismo when you're that age. Yeah, well, I mean, even then, I feel like my desk still look like a mess. I never was really organized. It's only like, actually, what I did, Chris, I don't know if you did this, mm. but I put folders- oh, fuck off. I put folders in, like, backup, uh, volume C, uh, monitor X or V or something like that, and yeah. then in that is a hidden folder <laughs> that's smart. I used to that's have what hidden I folders did. and shit, too. That's usually what I did. It Dude. was fun. Although, I don't know if I told this story. I, I feel like I might have, um... It's it's also kind of on topic because oh, we're boy. playing a Sonic game, but my dad, uh, when he, it's also kind of my dad's fault that I was even into the shit to begin with. Oops. But there's this thing <gasps> called uh, Pal Comics. Yeah. And I had downloaded a bunch of the comics, um, because I was gonna practice drawing like the porn, like I was gonna practice drawing the bodies and like learning anatomy and also jerking off to it later. <laughs> yeah. And. Oh. Uh, my dad had brought the computer to a, a guy, like an IT guy. And he confronted me about it, and he showed- he, the guy had fucking printed off the pictures, and there was like 10 pictures of these like, really bad- <laughs> He printed off your porn? Yeah, what and like- loser. And he gave them to my dad, and my dad gave them to me. <laughs> and he's like, do you want to talk about this? I'm like, oh yeah, I downloaded that. <laughs> he, like he was expecting this like long pep yeah, what talk. Yeah, what do you expect? But like... I smacked him with like, oh yeah, no I downloaded that. I'm sorry, and he's like, oh, don't do it again, and that was it, it was conversation over. Man, I remember the, one of the very first times I went on a porn spree when I was, like, pretty young, my mom and dad found a bunch of history. And Dude, they, they once were, you learn how to delete history, you're I didn't know going. about history, like, like they fucking, like, either. kicked my feet out from underneath me, they're like, Chris, come into the kitchen, oh, right? No. And they- These stories make me fucking They cringe. sit me down and they're like, so we're, we're noticing some weird looking things in the history here, and oh, it, it was no. very vague. All of the websites weren't called like, man, fucks woman. It was all like stuff like, <laughs> it was just weird vague words I can't even remember. But they're, but they're like, Chris, if we click on this, it's not gonna be anything bad, right? And I was just like, uh, no, no. <laughs> and then they were like, they they stopped and they paused for like five seconds. And it was, my heart was pounding and sweating and it was like, Okay, and I deleted it. No, they didn't even click on it. I was like, <gasps> like Oh my like, god. Why did they not click on it just to fuck with me? I don't understand. I would have done it. What? I gotta tell you the first- Oh no, death chamber. Alright, well it's time to turn my brain off. <laughs> this place fucking sucks. Okay, so... I, I gotta tell this story. So the first time I found out about, like, history and that you can't delete it, 
You can delete it. Well, I, did, I didn't know that uh, how you search through like the address bar, it like saves it permanently unless you do a certain thing. Yeah. So what Ooh. ended up happening was like, um, I was with my sister. We were just fucking around. I was actually, this is weird to even think it was with my sister. And <laughs> we, I was with my sister and we were just like typing in things like poop and pee and shit in like, uh, in the search engine. And then we we typed in like gay men and like fucking dicks and stuff. <laughs> and the first website is like cowboys and stuff. And we were like laughing, but it was like really like low quality like websites and shit. And it was like the kind of stuff you'd see on uh, NeoGAF. And mm. I didn't know that the literal search term of gay men would be in the address <laughs> bar. <laughs> when my dad opened the fucking search term for Google. Yeah. So. <laughs> Oh no. <laughs> he fucking he called me and he's like, oh, get in here. <laughs> <laughs> and he typed in Google and gay men appear. <laughs> <laughs> and he had the website with the gay cowboys like pulling the pants slightly down and I'm like, oh shit. <laughs> and I was like, fuck. And he's like, what is this? What's the meaning of this? And then my, Maybe since it was me and my sister, it's like, we didn't know. He's like, oh, you were both doing this? Mm. And he's like, oh, you looking for penises and shit? And it was, we were also laughing, so he's getting really pissed. Yeah. But, oh my god. It, it's just so funny. You never realize that, like, a letter will be associated with the fucking search term. <laughs> oh god, it was so funny. It's hilarious. <sighs> fucking, uh, did you ever have that I moment when this. you were younger where you're like, am I gay? And then you try it? Yeah, I, it I tried sticking stuff in my ass, I didn't like it. <laughs> I, it didn't work out. I didn't. I didn't mean like that. I smelled like watching I tried a, a bananas in like CD cases and didn't work. <laughs> Sticking CD cases in your ass. Yeah, the ones with the rods that you put CDs <laughs> on. I used the trash bag as a condom. I think I said this. It's <laughs> you know. <laughs> you guys don't even understand. You guys are lucky. You didn't realize. You guys actually had like a functioning internet as oh, a child. Oh no. Yeah, you you're uh I'm since I'm a million years old, I didn't I barely even had I had a I had a modem. I had to call up the phone line. Like no, a Jeff, as a kid I had a modem. modem. I had a modem up until I was like my 13. dad my you know, I oh. guess like I don't know, I guess I was like curious about girls or whatever at a young age and my my dad was like uh, can I restart this sucks. Yeah. We went to like <laughs> what was it like playboy.com and it's like it took I swear it took like five minutes to load one fucking image And it just started like going like line by line and then yeah. my dad just like winks at me He's like yeah, you just sit here you check this out. He leaves the room what? But, but I just I swear to God. How old were you? I was very young. Well, I, wasn't that I was old. one. I was one year old I was my two. old man set me down on his lap made me watch porn. <laughs> I don't know. Old. I was like 12 or 13 okay, That's, that's be, normal fun. Like And he's like you yeah, yeah, you check that out, but it was like I'm just sitting there this just making sure you weren't gay. <laughs> well, I, I, I would. Master I would, plan. He'd probably, he probably would have been one of those guys. Maybe mildly sad if I was, but you know, yeah. I don't yes. know. I don't know. I'm sure he would have been accepting either way. <laughs> but Dad, I don't want to watch. Bomb. Did you have any terms like that though? Whoa, terms. Yeah, like, did you do anything like what I just did? Like, did you search for stuff without, like, realizing- Did you like, shove liners up your ass? Um, <laughs> yeah, did you- Did you search- put Crayola markers in your ass? <laughs> did you fill up liners with farts and let, let them loose? It's funny, my dad had this, um- Yeah? I think he had this- I like how you just went- He had like this porn, I think, that was that. on, um, floppy disks. Oh, God. And they were- they were almost like GIFs at that time, they but they- or like, 64 megabytes, right? No, it was like 1 meg or something. Dude, it Worse. was crazy. Like, those literal black floppy disks. Yeah. They yeah. had, like, one point one megs or something. It was Jeez. crazy. But it was like a black and white animated GIF, which was like, it, I, at the time, it was like, whoa, this is like full motion video. That's and, crazy. You know, he hid those discs. I found them. And I watched you, them. <laughs> My uncle had a bunch of weird fucking porn magazines. Yeah. They, were, they were called Bizarre, and they they had both porn and gory pictures in them. Yeah. Really? Yeah. That's fucking, creepy. Yeah. Fuck you, uncle. Fuck you, uncle. <laughs> My dad's made me see weird shit. Like I, I think I said this before, but yeah. like my dad showed me like the faces of evil, um, yes. which is a really really fucked up thing. It's in and there. Ooh. It's in here. Yeah. Yeah, I figured. Sure looks like it. Um. So, okay, there we go. So he showed me the face of evil, and he's like, he's like, yeah, you're not gonna like this. 
Um, he's yeah. like, but I'll let you watch it. I'll see. Like he he was curious how much I could watch it. Like he wasn't sure if I would avert my eyes, but <laughs> seeing animals get like fucking just like seeing that kind of shit was like I couldn't look away. It's almost like you know when you see like a car accident, you're just like fascinated by like the idea of a car accident happening. Yeah. And your head can't turn away. So he was like, all right, yeah, you need to stop watching this. And he and he like did that. But then he would like turn on things like Indiana Jones, the scene where the guy's face is melting off, <laughs> and he would turn it in slow motion and laugh as I fucking bawled my eyes off. And he'd just like keep like the fucking the guy's like face melting. Yeah. yeah. He would turn that up to fucking. Let me ask 11. you like YouTube, like what what was like traumatic shit you saw as like a little kid? Traumatic oh, shit. Wait, wait, yeah. Uh, not not traumatic, but uh, while well, we're still on the same subject, it could be movies or whatever. No, traumatic. one time I was in in the kitchen. The kitchen was where we used to always like hang out, do yeah. homework, watch TV, oh, and know. all this other shit. And uh, we'd always go to go in and have dinner. But one time, my mom was making dinner, and I was just sitting there waiting for my dad to get home from mm -hmm. work. And my sister was like in her room or whatever. So it's just me and my mom. And then my dad walks in. And then right as he walked in, this show started, and it was called Euro Trash, mm -hmm. and it was like. I was like, oh, what's Euro Trash? I've never heard of this. And then it was just like, welcome to Euro Trash, where everything blah. As it started talking about really gross shit, mm -hmm. but it's like, now let's begin. Here we have 40 naked men hanging out, <laughs> wrestling in the dirt. And it's like, and, and it, it talks about like their fucking dicks and stuff. And you can see their dicks like, and they're all wrestling oh each other God. and flopping around in the mud. That's yeah. hilarious. And then like, and then it's, it played a song that was like, 20 centimeters, and it's like talking about their dicks being 20 centimeters long and shit. Yeah. And my dad just walks in, he's like, WHAT THE FUCK IS GOING ON?! <laughs> it's like, it just came on! I don't know, it, it, it's on TV! And he was so fucking pissed off, he's like, DON'T YOU EVER WATCH THAT AGAIN! And I was like, I won't. Oh my god. It's like, what, it, like, I, it was just on fucking regular old TV, I don't fucking understand. 